Here he comes, the best in the world. And he's not here to make friends. He's here to make money. champion contests is scheduled for one fall making his way to the ring from chicago illinois weighing in at 218 pounds the wwe champion c m punk and c m punk made his return with a flood of emotions but he knows he now has unfinished business and a story of his own to complete after nearly a decade away from WWE, Punk can still compete at a high level. And he'll need that with today's competitors. A polarizing figure, but Punk is determined to be the best. I gotta tell you, it still feels so surreal to see CM Punk back in a WWE ring. It's almost like destiny led him back home. Never say never in WWE, and CM Punk is ready to prove himself all over again. It's time to get a scream! And his opponent from Philadelphia, weighing in at 240 pounds, the ECW Heavyweight Champion, The Sandman! Guys, let me tell you, Sandman suffers from something of a disturbing love of weapons, and he's never afraid to use them. No one embodies the essence, the spirit of ECW, quite like the Sandman. And the Sandman's about to show us his passion for hardcore brawls. Sandman is a guy who quite simply refuses to conform and demands victory by any means. You will find no rules, no mercy, and no protection from the Sandman. Here we have CM Punk, the self-proclaimed best in the world, but even his biggest detractors would have to admit he's got the resume to back that claim up. Absolutely. Iconic matches against legendary superstars, shocking championship victories, long title reigns. Punk has done it all, and he's ready to do it all again. A big win here certainly would help silence those haters and help cement his claims.
And he's facing one of the most hardcore superstars we've ever seen, the Sandman. It's kind of funny to think that he originally had a laid-back surfer personality, which is a long way from the beer-chugging, cane-swinging man who we now see in the ring today. Although there's nothing funny about the way he viciously attacks his opponents in and out of the ring. Ow. Ooh, stiff punch. Counter by CM Punk. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. Any good tips for taking out a grizzled veteran like CM Punk? Someone who has gone head-to-head -head with all-time greats? Punk may have a ton of invaluable experience, but it took him plenty of mileage to get it. And that adds up. I'd target his joints, any old battle wounds, those places where the years of competition have really taken a toll. And with an onslaught of strikes like that, it's clear they have nothing but punishment on their mind. He saw it coming, taking advantage. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. Isolating the foot, the foot DDT. And Sandman struggling a bit. Bulldog. Boom. Slips out of the way. Bulldog. And he's out of there in a nick of time. He's heading to the floor, but he can't take his time. Nice sit-out powerbomb. No muss, no fuss on that delivery. Someone clearly doesn't want this match to go on much longer than it has to. And just planting them with that DDT there. Oh my gosh, what impact! And he slides him back to the mat. Sleeper hold cinched in deep. And just able to make it to the ropes. That was a close call. Down to Odin. And a double axe handle smash. This one is headed outside, guys. And gets tossed back into the mat. Has him up for the power slam from behind. And an inverted DDT. Able to get the advantage here. Counters with an attack on Sandman. And misses on the springboard. He moved, but can he capitalize? Ronnie pulls off. And he goes for the pin. He narrowly avoids the count. Able to squeeze that shoulder out. So close. Oh, this is just disrespectful. And an elbow drop, too. Oh, CM Punk stopped that in its tracks. Sandman was waiting for it. Producing a trampling. I don't know if Punk can withstand much more of this. This is a clever strategy. From the top. Elbow drop. Good Lord. He's just getting beaten on all fronts here. There is no way this can go on for much longer. Got to find a way to get out of this. Targeting the throat there. Oh my goodness, dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. Gets him with the counter. CM Punk doing what he can to halter the beatdown. Maybe Punk's found a new source of aggression to battle back with. Oh, saw it coming. Punk looking for GTS. Got to sleep. Crucial moment for the Sandman. Makes a cut. of mind. I thought he was unconscious. CM Punk looking to cinch in the Anaconda Vice. What a unique submission. Kneeing his way out. And he's free. Left hook in the mush. Lighten up the chest and now straight to the knee. Getting carried around. Sandman's number there. Our ringer applied. Top this lock. Opponent down to one knee. Oof. But here comes the fire. Drop kick. Great 
athleticism. Does he get him here? No, the two count. And you got to think, he's just one final blow away from not kicking out next time. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. Heads outside, but this one has to end in the ring. Vicious right forearm. DDT planet. Thrown back in under the ropes. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Perched up top. A diving knee drop. And Sandman has been taking an enormous amount of abuse in this match. Playing possum. Shoulders down. And he fights it off. There's some shock in the arena after that kick out. And an impact. Sandman has him hooked. Pile driver. Well, Sandman can have this one. get the win. Here is your winner, the Sandman. The Sandman with an extreme win tonight. Punk's going to hit the showers with this loss weighing heavy on him. But best believe, Punk will be coming back from this with a vengeance.